that I was staying at spoke a word of English. So it was very interesting to try and communicate what was, what was meant to be going. I wasn't quite sure what I was meant to be doing or where I was meant to be going. They were leading me around and pointing into hot pools and scrubbing brushes and oil baths, and I was just sort of figuring it out. And it was an amazing experience. And one of the treatments I received was with a fine powder that was exfoliated over my whole body in very small, tiny circles. My skin felt amazing. I couldn't find out what it was, but it was in a sort of a bucket, so it was clearly made on premises. Some kind of gesticulations and a little bit of amateurish drawing realized it was made from rice. And when I came back to the United States, I spoke to Dr. Diana Howard, and I said, you know, my skin was amazing, and rice. And Diana said, I don't think, I, what rice? I don't think there's really anything there. But let me look into it. She did the research and found out that rice is rich in phytic acid. And Diana said, you know what? Not only is it smoothing, it is, has a brightening ability for the skin, too. We went to work. Marketing team did an incredible job. And 15 years ago, Daily Microfoliant was born. But now, as Aurelian said, it's kind of time to reveal a new product, new technology, and new skin. We are, it's taken us 15 years to find a product that was sort of the worthy, the worthy successor, if you want, to Daily Microfoliant and a very worthy sibling. So our brand new product that we're going to share with you today is Daily Superfoliant. Thank you. The reason this product is so incredible, and when you use it, be prepared, you're about to become a The reason that this is, is so important for us now is that the innovation we've built into this product is tackling what we know and believe will be the number one issue around skin going forward, and that is pollution. And you're going to hear why. So we've all, we all well, those of us have been in the industry for a long time, and I qualified in 1976, so that gives you an idea. Last century, I qualified in the last century. <laughs> we were, at that stage, we were busy saying, we think sun damage is going to be a big issue. There was no SPF, so there was no such thing as an SPF. And people were like, oh, how bad can it be? I mean, they say the sun's good for you. And now we look back on that and think, that was crazy. I mean, we had tanning beds that clients were going on in the salons that we were offering skin treatments in. So now we know how detrimental the sun is and everything supports it. We believe similarly with pollution. We are on the brink and the cusp of a major push forward on this. And this innovation is built into this product ahead of anyone else. You will have it in your hands, literally in your hands, very, very soon, today in fact. And you will see the results for yourself. The product is extraordinary. And one of the benefits that we've had in the last 18 months is having the resources available to us to do the research, to have the technology, and to really be able to make the claims of a product that we know is not only a worthy uh, uh, sibling to daily microfoliant, but it has a highly active resurfacer. You are going to have the smoothest skin you've ever had. No dryness. I would say that it is the, a, a completely different technology that you're going to experience. And the key thing is it fights the biochemical issues that are really triggering a lot of skin damage. And you're going to hear about that in just a couple of minutes. We would not introduce a product to succeed, stand alongside, and be a partner product to Daily Microfoliant if it wasn't extraordinary. For me, I've had the advantage, of course, of having Daily Superfoliant, as all of our marketing and R&D team have for several months. I have Daily Microfoliant in my shower. I've always used Daily Microfoliant every day. I now have the Superfoliant that I use probably three times a week, so I use both products because I find the combination of the two is amazing. I'm very, very proud and excited about this product. I would not stand up and say anything about a product that I didn't believe in and didn't use myself. I'm excited for you to use it and to recommend it to your clients. It is perfect for this time of year when we need to exfoliate, but even more perfect for the years ahead. 
and to share with you the research and development that went into this product, I'm always excited to introduce my co-conspirator, my collaborator, my partner in crime, our head of technology and development and research, Dr. Diana Howard. because the effects of the environment on the skin, we all know what that's all about. We've been talking to our clients about the impact of UV radiation on the skin. And we've known that air pollution has had an impact on skin, but we really haven't had the scientific backing to prove what that impact is until now. Now, a lot of people who are maybe at home watching us, not necessarily here in this room, because let's face it, we have the distinct honor in Los Angeles of being the smoggiest city in the United States. So some of you at home are going, oh, I'm so glad I'm not in LA. But I want to tell you something. If you live in a city that is in amber or the gold color here, you live in an area that exceeds the World Health Organization's safe levels of air pollution. 92% of us in the world live in a city where those limits are exceeded. That's a real problem. And those of you overseas in Europe, well, 33% of the cities in the US exceed the safe levels. 93% of the cities in the EU exceed those safe levels. If you live out in farm country, you might be thinking, this isn't for me. I don't have to worry about it. I don't live in a city. That's why I don't live in a city. I got news for you. Guess what the second most polluted, air, air polluted city is in the nation? Bakersfield. <laughs> Carolyn out there, I know you're here. She's from Bakersfield. <laughs> the third, Stockton and Visalia. Now the list goes on and on and on and you might be thinking, how can that be? because every time those tractors go down the road, they're raising dirt, dust particles. And you're gonna see very shortly, that is a critical component of air pollution. And what we know today is so far beyond talking about ozone and polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, because that's what everybody thinks about when they think of air pollution, right? And nitric oxides and sulfur dioxide, there's something called particulate matter, and that particulate matter gets coated with these chemicals, and that has just been deemed a carcinogen by the World Health Organization. When we think about the word air pollution, we are thinking about particulate matter as well as all of those chemicals. The best way for you to envision what is particulate matter is when you see a beam of light going in a dark room and you see those little particles flying around, okay? That's particulate matter. For every visible particle you see, there's a million you don't see. That's particulate matter. Now, let's put it in perspective. If you were to pull out one of the hairs off your head, if you don't have any hair, borrow one from your neighbor. <laughs> and look at the relative size of that hair. Now, particulate matter is classified in two different size categories. There's the coarse, which we refer to as PM10, and there's the fine called PM2.5. Now the PM10 is, and that's how it's often referred to, and when you read an article or, or do any research on it, that's the pollen, the mold spores, the dust particles. The PM2.5, that's the um, organic compounds, the products of combustion from industry and our automobiles. So, if you were to look at that hair that you plucked out of your head and know that its diameter is 50 to 70 microns, a PM10 particle is 10 microns. So if you were to line up these particles across the shaft of hair, you can see you're going to put 10, five particles lined up that are PM10s. You're going to put 20 particles lined up across that hair if it's a PM 2.5. So you see how small it is we're talking about? And to add insult to injury, these particles, even if it's just dust from farmland, get coated with the chemicals those 
organic chemicals that are the chemical air pollutants in our air that we breathe. And they're so small that they can fall into the pores. And a regular cleanse, even a Dermalogica double cleanse, is often not enough to get those particles with the chemicals out. Now, why is this a problem? The scientific community knows that there is a link between air pollution exposure and something we call inflammaging. Inflammaging is when you are exposed to these air pollutants, they cause oxidative stress, which leads to inflammation, which leads to premature aging in the skin. And all of the things associated with premature aging, such as uneven skin tone, skin sensitivity, hyperpigmentation, dehydration, loss of elasticity, all of these things, these factors, including even acne and increased sensitivity, all of these now have been scientifically proven to be associated with exposure to air pollutants, including that particulate matter. And that's why Daily Superfoliant is such a fantastic product that, as Jane says, you will literally get your skin addicted to. It smooths away that skin aging pollution because those pollutants lead to that premature aging is the exact reason why we put it in the Age Smart segment of products. What is Daily Superfoliant? Just like its sister, Daily uh, Microfoliant, it's a super active powder that gets activated when you add water and it releases these active ingredients, which I'll explain to you in a moment, that gives your, cell, your skin the most ultra smooth resurfaced finish. It's absolutely incredible. But at the same time, the anti-pollution ingredients that are in there are fighting those pollutants, really deep, thoroughly cleansing your pores, your skin, to remove those pollutants, which could continue to cause premature aging in the skin. If you had to say to a client, you know, this is what Daily Superfoliant does, the way I would sum it up is say, not only does it fight pollution, it's designed specifically with the ingredients that we have in there, namely the binchotan charcoal, which we'll talk about more in a, mo a minute, that adsorbs those air pollutants that are in the skin, but it resurfaces the skin. Now, one of the things that really is a distinguishing factor with this product is that it opens the pores. Daily microfoliant tightens the pores. We're able to open the pores by virtue of the pH that we use. Daily microfoliant is a 4.5 pH, the acid pH of our skin, keeps the skin tight and smooth. In daily superfoliant, we purposely put it at a pH of 7.2, which you know is above neutral, so it expands those pores, so we can deep cleanse those air pollution particles, the particulate matter and the chemicals that are deep in the pores, causing that inflammation and premature aging. We use two alpha hydroxy acids, malic acid from al apples and lactic acid to resurface the skin. We combine it with a trio of enzymes, not just papain, but lipase and subtilicin as well are in there. The end result is a resurfaced finish. And I want all of you when you try this product to just do half your face with it so that when you pat your skin dry, you can feel that difference. It's absolutely incredible. Now the key to this, how we really are making it an anti-pollution product, is by using that binchotan charcoal that has been activated. And this adsorbs those pollutants. We also put a very unique complex in there called an anti-adherence complex that helps prevent pollutants from adhering to the skin. And of course we have age-fighting antioxidant niacinamide in there which helps the skin repair itself. One of the things about charcoal that you may know from the charcoal rescue mask launch is here you see a picture of activated binchotan charcoal that comes from the Obami oak and this has been heated to 1800 degrees uh, Fahrenheit and what happens is it creates these micropores and this increases the surface area so that the pollutants and particulate matter adheres to it. And that's how the activated charcoal al allows all these chemical pollutants to adhere to it and then you can wash it away. One teaspoon of charcoal has the surface area of a tennis court. 
Now I'm going to show you a quick little demonstration. I put red food coloring in this water, and I've got a little beaker of some Binchotan charcoal here. I'm going to stir it up, and I'm going to pour it through this. I just have filter paper in my funnel. And while we continue this, I'm going to let it drip through the funnel, and you're going to see the water that's going to come out is going to be clear. That Binchotan charcoal is adsorbing the dye molecules that are in the water here. And that's exactly how, whoop, there, oh, I spilled it in there. It's how, oops, I have a tear in my filter paper here. We'll do it again after. Okay, so the anti-adherence complex. This is one of my favorite new plants. This plant is Cecilpinia spinosa from Peru. I was hoping to get a picture of it for you. Even hiked in the Andes last month so that I could get that picture. And unfortunately, I didn't find that, but I found some other fabulous plants we're going to talk about in about a year and a half from now. But <laughs> we, we combined the, what I do for you guys. We combined the Cecilpinia with a red seaweed, and this complex puts, now it's coming out clear. This, you can see the clear water coming out there. So you can see how the charcoal absorbs the red dye molecules. So the Cecilpinia combined with the elk um, horn sea moss, it puts a molecular mesh on the surface of the skin, preventing adhesion of air pollutant molecules to that skin. We know our best seller daily microfoliant is for normal skin conditions. It tightens the pores, as I said earlier, and part of that is the pH of the product we do, we use. It gently microfoliates so you can use it every day, but it really brightens and smooths the skin. The daily superfoliant opens those pores. It allows us to evacuate and clean out the air pollutants in the particulate matter. It resurfaces the skin much more than daily microfoliant that just microfoliates the skin. And you can feel the difference in the two. And it detoxifies, it remo removes those impurities, but also it helps protect the skin from additional impurities adhering. I did this chart, we're not gonna go into it in detail. You can see it in the training manual. And what I did is I took the two products and the active ingredients, and the bar represents the level of those active ingredients. So for example, the papain. You can see daily superfoliant in the maroon has three times the amount of papain. The lipase and subtilicin enzymes, there is none in daily microfoliant. So this just gives you an idea. There's no similarity other than the fact they're both in powder form. And that's what I wanted to get across to you there. You know how I get excited about ingredients. I could talk about them all day, but there's this clock ticking up there that says that's enough. But just as excited as I get about talking to you about skin physiology and structure and ingredients, there are people amidst, amongst us that get excited about talking about widgets. So it's, to explain to you our <laughs> atomic API widget, there is no better person to do this than our CEO who loves technology, and I'd like to bring up Aurelian again. Thank you, Diana. So, yes, I get to do the nerdy bits. That's all good fun. Um, you excited about the product? Yeah. Excited about the education? Yeah. Right? This idea of teaching our consumers the link between aging and skin pollution is huge. Right? People know that pollution's an issue for, the breathe, for what you breathe, and, and that's nothing new. But the idea of that you're actually causing aging by skin pollution is something very, very new, and that's what we're addressing. We want to bring that consumer education further, so what we're doing is indeed bringing out a widget. So this is the only time you'll ever be allowed in a meeting to pull out your cell phones, Swipe by at the picture of your daughter. <laughs> and then go to one of the ways would be skinpollution.com. And it very quickly, for whatever time of day it is, wherever you are, you get the reading, which looks a bit like this. It asks you to say what your location is. Let's move on. And it gives you a reading. This morning, we're at 42. It's a high risk of accelerated skin aging. 
The dominant pollutant is inhalable particulate matter. Maybe that's why I lost my voice. Some facts, some consumer education. So it's a very important way of us bringing this to our consumers. When we build tools like this, in terms of skin recognition, uh, recommendations, did you knows, FAQs, it's about helping you, our professional skincare therapists, be able to share that with your audiences. And so we build these as widgets that you can integrate where you need them. So the first thing we play, you can put and find it is what we just did, which is just going to a cell phone and looking at skinpollution.com. The second way that you can push that forward is to embed it. So we got code that you put into your emails yourself. So when you're sending your customers emails, let's, let's have that data there and on the ready so they don't even have to look at it. We also have ways to embed it into your in into your in-house systems. We do that through something called APIs. You can see why they call me nerdy. <laughs> it seems difficult, but the stuff's actually quite easy, right? So for example, to embed the widget in your website or in an email, you'd have to take this HTML, which is JavaScript, and paste it in. And you get an image delivered. It's just like putting a photo in HTML. So we're there to help. Um, you, your BC is there to help, will help you through it, but I think it's a, it's a very interesting way of sort of saying, what can we do? And what you will see us, we're also trying to educate the bigger public on it. So for example, Women's Wear Daily, um, I believe, is running some stories on this, on this product, and they, at the same time as running those stories, will be running the results of the widget, so the people in different parts of the world will start seeing it. See, the exciting thing is now, we know it's 42 here, right? But then you think, hmm. My brother is in New York. I wonder if he's got it worse or better than I have. Hmm, I'm going to Scandinavia for the vacations. Is it really as clean as they say it? And you can do world travel with it as well. So, wonderful thing. So, that was the first one. The second thing that we are doing, it's time for a sell-through contest. A real good, just an incredible contest. So, who likes a contest? Come on. Yeah, there's a competitive spirit, right? This is going to be a global contest because we don't like national boundaries anymore and because this product actually is launching worldwide on January 3rd at 10 a.m. in about half the globe. The other half is probably February, March, but half the globe's already January. So we'll run a contest for January and February. There's two months. So what's important with contests? Winning. Winning. <laughs> How about prizes? Well... A global first prize is for two people. It will be travel and a trip to Los Angeles. For you guys here, it may be not quite as exciting. <laughs> but we'll give you a hotel of your choice as well. And there's some beautiful places to stay downtown. And dinner, a one-on-one -on -one dinner with our chief visionary and founder, Jane. Just think how much that's worth. Priceless. We have first prizes, $1,000 travel vouchers, $1,000 in Dermalogica product, $500 Apple gift cards, and in the UK equivalent, 500 pounds, 100 regional prizes, others. So it's pretty fun, right? And because of it's the spirit of competing, we also have leaderboards so you know just where you are. The way we'll do this on every product, as you know, we have diversion tracking codes. Those codes are on the top of our products, as you can see there. You take that five-digit alphanumeric code, you plug it into a website, which you find at demologica.com slash launch, if you're a professional skincare therapist, and you get one point for every one you sell. Simple. So, what's it all about? We're smoothing away skin aging pollution. Summary, a beautiful sequel to Daily Microfoliant. It launches January 3rd at 10 a.m. If you want to be part of it, if you want to, as a therapist, try it beforehand, the best way is pre-order it now. It's available for pre-order as we speak, and you will get your advanced samples now before it goes to the public, because we want you to be involved. We want you to know all about the product. 
so that when you start talking to your consumers next year on January 3rd, you're ready to go. Excitement? There's silence. No, we're excited for this, right? So thank you very much. Let's show one round of applause for all the people who put some wonderful work in creating this product. Thank you very much. And goodbye to our international listeners. Thank you. Have a All right, so we have waved goodbye to our friends that are tuning in via the stream. So now it's all about us. Who is ready to try the product? All right.